is up, Hacker Clan. Hey guys, we're here. Are you guys here? Is there the chat? Is oh hey, our chatbot's frozen. Oh no! <laughs> I should have I should have checked that. I gotta restart. I gotta oh, restart the pod. No. It's coming back. No. It's coming back. No wonder we couldn't. No no wonder nothing was happening in the chat. Things were happening in the chat, and we just couldn't see it. I wasn't really. Well, we are, uh, it's been, what, like two weeks since the last time we were on here? Something like that. Something like that. Um, <laughs> we, uh, no clue. we would have done a stream last week, but we were oh, hey. out of town. We are indeed here. All right. Hi, guys. We are here. Kyle has a beard. Yes, I do. Ah. Okay, yeah, so it's been about two weeks. Because <laughs> the beard has been growing for about two and a half, I cool. think. So, uh, yeah, I know. Like it. Uh, at some point, you guys are going to see me with a ridiculous mustache. It's going to be amazing. I'm also going to make him wear 70s gear. <laughs> um, so, yeah, it's been, a, it's been a couple weeks because Caitlin and I went to Mississippi and hey, do you guys remember when I built that Zazu puppet thing? Anybody remember? Yeah. That? Um. So that was for. Did we show that off on Twitch? <laughs> I brought his head. I was like, "That's right." Look at his head. He's almost done. Um, and uh, so we worked on uh, Pumba, the Pumba puppet. Yeah. For, well, our sister. Yeah. Dawn. Um, and it was fun, and we like visited with family. And Caitlin looks swole AF, like oh. muscly. Oh. <laughs> we just went climbing, actually. Yeah, so we I probably climbing. am, like, and then she, and then she spent, out. Then she spent some time on the elliptical, too, so. I did too. She got a good little I needed good little to workout. move. I was watching The Crown, because I'm a total nerd and a total Anglican. <laughs> True. So, um... We decided we wanted to, this is my second stream with you guys. Well, welcome, Haru. Thanks. Uh, thanks for being here. We are going to continue <laughs> our playthrough of What Remains of Edith Finch yeah. tonight. That fucking weird game with, like, the shark that was rolling down the hill for God knows what reason. I don't know. Yeah. And I think we might be able to finish it. I don't think it's a terribly lengthy game. And we probably got... Maybe halfway, yeah. maybe a little less. I don't know. We'll see. I have no clue. I don't um, even remember we can, where we were. We can kind of tell based on how much of the family tree we've explored, I think. Oh, yeah. So Nothing. let's load it up. And then, uh, let's see, let's go over to here. And in the game, we press this. There we go. It worked. First time. Oh, you're welcome, well, thank Silent you, Melody. Silent Melody. And you're, and you're a subscriber. Oh, oh, how about I uh, I actually go through and do some shout-outs? Oh, yeah, we should, like, should do probably that do first. that. Oh, yeah, Walter is, like, down in the weird pit area with Peaches. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's where we left off. Millions uh, Peach. So just a couple shout-outs to give since the last time we played. Uh, let's see. Sean Braun X subscribed. Welcome. Mm -hmm. To Hacker Clan. Lucarkia subscribed. I think you had subscribed at some point, Lucarkia, but uh, obviously the subscription lapsed and Mike I is can hardly fuzzy. blame you. Mike is fuzzy. Mike fuzzy is fuzzy. Mike. Fuzzy Mike. Mike, Mike fuzzy. sounds fuzzy. Oh, it might be a subscription lapse. That might be why. I'm also, uh, let's see. Let's see if that helps. Um, He's a fan of us. I'm also using the, uh, the all the gear that we use for this microphone for this one, and it hasn't really been uh, calibrated that well yet. How horrible is it? So is it still bad? If it's any, if it's not any better right now, guys, I'll uh, I'll hop up and adjust some things. Um. So. Hi, 
couple more shout outs while you guys while you guys get caught up and you can tell me if we have fixed it or not uh lukarki is subscribed i mentioned that and silver Solsora resubscribed for a ninth month wow whale hey 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 whale hey 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 long time no see hope everyone's doing well and having a fantastic time less than three three s That's, uh, that's about it. Your voices is great to me in the stream, okay? Uh, anybody else? It's not horrible, it's only slightly it's fuzzy. Huh. I have no clue. Well, let me see something. Maybe, right. maybe, maybe there's some loose. Put on the headphones and listen to it. Hello? Oh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's awful. Why is that happening? Ew. Oh, That's, no. That is gross. Okay, give me a second while I fix that. I'm just gonna sit here. What's up, guys? <laughs> Let's... We'll be back with sound in just a second. I don't want to make your ears bleed while I unplug things and plug them back in. Hello, check one, two. I can't hear. Huh. It's showing that it's, that it's doing things. Can you guys hear us? Can you hear us? Can you hear us? now can you hear us better now oh, nope better 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 yes yes better still quiet better better now we can hear you is it fuzzy is it still fuzzy I can hear it's still you quiet better. much better can, can you hear you clearly you okay good oh Okay. Okay. I don't know what was going on, but uh, I'll have to do some <sighs> oh, testing and stuff to see if I can make that work later. But for now, we'll do it this way. Okay. Sorry, gang. 
Uh, a couple more shout outs came in while I was fixing stuff. It's simply Maria resubscribed for a seventh month. Thank you, Maria. And Kitty Gamer 109 just subscribed. Welcome to Hacker Clan. Thank you both. Woo. Let's play some What Remains of Edith Finch. Caitlin. Yeah. Oh. Controls are yours. Oh, God, I don't remember how to do this. Oh, I'm gonna shit. sit back and relax oh, and watch I'm this. sure my mom was trying to protect me. Oh no! Right, you have to hold it and then... Tuck it up with the right hand. Yeah. Oh boy. Hi Chloe, you wanna come mm. say hi to the people? Come here, pup. Maybe she was afraid I'd end up like Walter. But if she never told me about an uncle under the house, I can only imagine what else she was hiding. Jay, I don't want to make the same mistakes she made. Far too kind of you. Jay is saying uh, he's, he's holding a lottery. Sorry. He's holding a lottery. Yeah. And uh, for everybody in the chat, I guess I guess uh, shout out at Jay, and he will um, add you to the pool. And one lucky person at the end of the stream will receive one full year of a subscription to the channel, wow. gifted to them by Jay. Thank you, Jay. That's cool. I'm guessing that's where you're supposed to go. Trying to bury something that's still alive. <laughs> now that there's only one of us left, or maybe two, I thought it was time I heard the stories for myself and found out what happened to everyone else. But now I'm worried the stories themselves might be the problem. Maybe we believed so much in a family curse, we made it real. Oh boy. Right, Walter got hit by the train when he was trying to escape. Um, <clears throat> by the way, subscribers, I am considering not jump off that. <laughs> Will it even let me? I don't know. Wait a second. Where was that train track go? Oh, okay. To the right. It was going that way and it, and it broke out. I was like, wh where was the train going? Just off into the ocean? Um. Anyway. Uh, I was gonna say, by the way, subscribers, I am considering starting some impromptu uh, anime watch parties, possibly through through a third party service. Obviously, not directly through Twitch, but. Uh, I can't go down there. I really want to go down there. I think that's where we're, we're supposed to go. Well, I think, yeah, I was gonna say, I think you would die if you jumped off of that ledge. Hey, you don't know. I don't know if I should even be writing this. Where do I check? What? Is, where is? She, where is she writing this? In the, in the journal. Is she the person we're controlling? Maybe it'd be better if all this just died with me. Yeah. I, like I've been assuming that this whole time, but maybe what if we're controlling somebody else? I don't, I don't but know. I thought you should know about your family. What is that? To the right. Oh. oh and right. the history you're a part of. <sighs> Whoops. Oh, the words just went in there. Great. We got a subscriber, Aqua Painter, resubscribed for a tenth month. Can't believe it's nearly been a year. Thanks for the great streams and voice acting, everyone. Also, tell Chloe and Simon I love them. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Aqua Painter. Poor Chloe. Where am I going? What is happening right now? You're looking around the beach. Can I go in the water? Let's go for a swim. 
Probably not. Ah. The game does start with someone opening Edith's journal, so yeah, so maybe. Maybe it's somebody else. I don't know if... Did we see if there was anybody else in the family that was still alive? I think she's the only person still alive in the family tree. Yeah. Well, it looks like there were stairs to go up. Though to be Not honest, to right. I feel as lost as you probably do right now. Ah, you're correct, madam. <laughs> I think the people in these stories believed them, for what that's worth. Nothing. Nothing at all. Uh, can you guys, can you guys hear us? Okay now. I didn't I obviously didn't set levels since I had to scramble to switch input sources there. If we're too quiet or too loud, just let us know. <laughs> it's a little dark. And when you look at the house, that history of imagination and stubbornness in madness, any of it seems possible. It's lighter than the game audio. I'll get up and give it a little bit of a boost. I think we've been surrounded by death for so long, we've just gotten used to it. There we go. Why can't I pick you up? Uh, maybe there's no fuel in it. I can't ride the bike. Maybe she doesn't know how. What kind of family finishes building a cemetery before starting the house? Oh, God. Ew. I don't want to go look at the graveyard. It's embarrassing for me to admit this, but... The pet cemetery may be more uncomfortable than the human one. Three of the gerbils are mine, and two had been my fault. Aww. Derpy. Derpy and Derpy Jr. <laughs> Burpy, chirpy, burpy, lurpy, zerpy. Those must be the gerbils. Those are probably dogs or cats or whatever. That has a freaking X through it. I did voice Rio and Devilman Crybaby, Kitty Gamer. What had an X through it? One of the graves. What, like, oh, never mind, they didn't actually die? <laughs> oh, look at people pr pressing F to pay respects with their lunar tears. <laughs> Sven built the house, but it was Edie who designed the cemetery. That's actually kind of sweet to have a little little cemetery for all the members of your family close to the house. I don't know. A little private family cemetery. Mm -hmm. Is it a coincidence that you've now voiced two major roles with I'm similar sure haircuts? I'm sure Odin's monument had been Edie's idea. My mom was always trying to move on, but for Edie, the past never went away. That are really good at hacking. Yes, it's a coincidence. <laughs> no, you meant to do it. 
But I don't think that Rio and 9S have a lot in she common. She could see so. it poking out of the water at low tide. What are we looking at? Can you swipe up on the right thing? Oh. Edie said she dreamed about the old house every night. Oh, that's right, she talked about the old house. This little walk? Is there not more? Nope. What about to the left up here? Anything? Edie's side was always easier oh. for me to understand. There we go. But the older I get, the more I can see where my mom was coming from. Her dad had been pretty strict, but it wasn't enough to save her brothers. She was just trying to do better. To the right? She lost two of her brothers, just like I did. I get why she tried so hard to protect us. Sanjay Kumar? That's not a finch. They adopt somebody? We never found Milton's body, so my mom insisted we were putting up a monument, not a tombstone. That's so sad. This game is very morbid. Might have been There's somebody so many things I wish I could ask my mom now. Part of me thinks this is what she wanted all along. For me to come back someday. And find everything out for myself. But looking back on it now... If she told me there was going to be so much climbing... Uh-oh. What, what are you supposed to do here? Walk towards the broken... section? I never would have come when I was 22 weeks pregnant. Oh! <gasps> We're pregnant! That's gonna break. That's gonna break and we're gonna fall. I would not walk on the skylights. I never met Grandpa Sam, but I think he and my mom had a lot in common. Quick, someone clip that and take it out of context. <laughs> Caitlin and I are not pregnant. Nope. I meant the character in the game that we are collectively playing as. I am 100% not they pregnant. You pretty can intense. Clip that. <laughs> no, Sam spent his life shooting photos, but Mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. Ew. I guess we're all afraid of something. I don't like that photo. Um, uh, actually, uh, Robbie Damond, his, uh, his fiance, I can't remember her name, is, is pregnant. Oh, for real? Yeah. Okay, good for them. Are they married now? I don't know. I don't think they've married, they've gotten married yet. I don't keep tabs on Robbie Damond. 
<laughs> Unlike many people. What? Megan, thank you. He's got a bunch of girl, girls who have crushes on him. So. Well, yeah, because... Because he's cause Robbie, he's Damon. Robbie Damon. Robbie Damon. They're engaged. Yeah, that's what I thought. Good for I them. Think that is so good. Back. What's well, I'm glad oh, that they are... I don't like this. This is... Babies. Oh, I don't like this at all. Is that your parents? That's our parents, right? Dear Kay, do you remember the way Gregory used to laugh when he thought he was alone? Like something funny was happening, but only he could see it. Aww. I think he saw things the rest of us don't. How old is this kid that you're leaving him in the bathtub? Damn, I told you I don't want to talk right now. I wonder what he saw. Little, little rubber duckies in bubbles. Less than a few months old? You don't leave a baby in the bathtub! you want them to drown. You reminded me so much of Captain. Yeah, just hit. Can you do Lost anything? Lost in his imagination. Nope. I can only just... You can only watch these little things yep. do what they're doing. The dance of the rubber duckies. Control the frog. And that's that's all you that's all you can do with him. Dance. Can I do the drain? I guess and now you knock into them, they just kind of go back into their little formation. You can jump. Can you jump out of the tub? And you can dive. He saw. Oh. Whoa. Sure happy. You you killed the whale. The whale goes in water. It's fine. upside down though. Be fine. Haha! <laughs> -ha. You fixed it. Do you have control of the whale now? Or is it dancing? It's dancing. in March in Jackson, Mississippi. Well, you should request that I go, Kitty Gamer, because Jackson is where we just were, and it would be, that would actually be great timing <laughs> to go to a con in Jackson in March. I, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just knocking everything off. Yeah, side. just just keep doing that. It, uh, yeah, it holds a lot more... Oh, what's... There's words on top of the whale. Um, 
I was gonna say that it holds a lot more weight when you request guests than it does when guests request themselves. <laughs> well, uh... Trampoline off the whale again. I can't move him. Uh oh, what happened? You can't do anything? <laughs> oh, you know what? You're probably supposed to jump onto the little handle and then jump up to something else from there. I can't. <sighs> Making progress. There you go, there you go. Oh, so close. God, this is so annoying. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> no, God. Ah. No. There were more words on the soap shelf. Okay, so that's where we're headed to. I'm trying. Yeah. Oh, I know what I have to do. No! That, that's the right idea, though. Ah, so close. I think, I think you were having, you were getting more mileage out of the backflip motion. Maybe not. <laughs> oh my god, this is so annoying. <laughs> I hate this. Do you, do you want me to try? I mean, I have no idea how you're doing it, so... There you go! You made, you made a couple more guys jump in. Tried bouncing off the whale. Yeah, I don't think she can go back into the tub. I can, can. it won't let me. Yeah. Oh my god, this is so stupid. <laughs> the mom is on a long phone call, yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Fuck you. Especially given that she's talking to somebody she said she didn't want to talk to. <laughs> Why? I don't know. Oh my god, I can't do it. Okay, okay. It's driving me crazy. How do, how do you do it? Okay, so that's how. I know how silly it sounds. No, uh, no, no movement control whatsoever. But I worried about a baby being too happy. We just let it. Ah. But I can feel him slipping away. <laughs> I know you did everything you could. What? Maybe if I hadn't called that night. Did the frog just get sucked Can't... through the whale? Hold on, I into don't the drain. To hear this. No. I wish you could have told us. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh no. I don't like this. I don't like it at all. No. About Gregory. About everything. Oh god. Are we the frog? Are we him? Yeah. Are we oh we're probably one of those little dudes. But I know what happened frog. wasn't my fault. Yeah, actually what happened was it was entirely my fault. What? Good luck, Kay. 
the baby oh, go down Sam. the drain? Seventy-six. So that... That wasn't her parents, then. Okay. Married into the family. To Sam. That was her grandparents. It's horrible. <sighs> So we have, what, like one, two, three, four more? Maybe five? Or six? I don't know. Uh-huh. That was horrible. That was, she was a bad mom. I'm sorry, you don't leave a baby in a bathtub without looking at him. There's no way mom didn't get arrested for child neglect, yeah. I can't imagine my mom ever writing poetry, and yet... Oh, no. Not another child. A poem for Gus, who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Our father never hit us kids, at least not very hard. Before the day my brother said with teenage disregard that he'd be dead before he'd see a wedding in our yard. My father made him come, of course, but Gus stood far apart, just flew his kite and bottled up the storm inside his heart. to talk him out of it, but though he'd never met her. We don't need a stepmom, were the words that I I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. When the time for photos came, Dad ordered him to come, come here. here. But Gus declined, and as a sign, held up his middle finger. geese appeared and quickly went. But all the humans did that day was go inside the tent. The tent is not going to protect you from the wind. Not much, anyway. Is the kite going to pick him up and carry him away? destroy the tent our dad had crudely made. Nobody cares. The thunder sounded much too close and full of angry power. But all my father said to this was, make the music louder. I wish that I could truly say I thought about you on that day. Out there on the beach alone, just you, the wind, the sea, and foam. Ah! But I didn't, until we found you. Well. Great. Cool. That's, that's, that's a feel-good story. She never talked about him, but Mom told me once if I was a boy, they were going to name me Gus. Mm. 
What about Dawn? Nothing happened to Dawn, huh? Maybe she didn't she didn't die as a child. Uh, where am I going? Up the rock wall? Yeah. Yeah. My mom moved up to the loft after her brothers died. Huh. That's, uh, Whoosh. we were just doing this. At the this... time, it was as far away as she could get. This version is a lot easier. Yes. <laughs> uh... Let's see, a subscription from Haruyuki. Thanks for the sub. Don't hurt your finger again, Kyle. Thanks. Thanks, Mendez. <laughs> Sunderica. Oh, hey. <laughs> what up? How's it going? What's, what is this? Dawn and Sanjay. She spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. Hmm. Looks like that tent caught him up and he got taken away. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's what happened. Erica, we are playing through what remains of Edith Finch. Uh-huh. My mom moved to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. It is morbid. Lewis morbid. was born a year later. I was going to say, I thought you had some writing to do, Erica. Yeah. Don't you have, like... Massive deadlines. You procrastinator. When my I dad died, I don't think I had anywhere else to go. Th thanks. <laughs> oh, Mendez. I'm sure Edie was happy to have her back. A lot of people who tune in apparently can't, though, because they'll, they'll come in and ask, so what, what game are they playing? And the house had say, to get a little bigger, but Edie was used to that. Yes, Erica Mendez. Things were good. RPG gamer. Almost RPG normal. Gamer. But it didn't last. Beginning of the end was Milton's 10th birthday, when Edie gave him a castle. Huh. That's cute. We should go to the castle. Hold on, what is this? Are we in a treehouse here? Let's go to the castle. I just want to see what this... No, this is just part of the weird house that we're in. But it's so cool. I want to live in this house. Except everybody who does dies. I mean, I want to live in a house like it, Kyle. Not one God. where everybody dies. Obviously, Kyle. <laughs> Into the house we go. Oh, hey, you know what? We figured out that... I know, you always do have writing to do. But shut up and let me be here so I can love you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Erica. That's fine, honey. We figured out that the fan was not the source of Oh, yeah, so that's our good. Trouble. Oh, hello, light. Ah. That's nice, too. Ow, Ooh. that... I was staring at that when that came that on. That is the least structurally secure house I've ever seen. Lunar clock, I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> you time max, you time max. What are we doing? Happening. Oh, okay. The rope. Oh, Milton. Oh, what? Okay, right. Milton disappeared. Yeah, we don't know. We where don't he is. know if he died or not. We're gonna find him. Milton Finch in the magic paintbrush. Wait, what's? Oh, I have to. Oh, it's a flip book. Sub. It's Erica. It's Erica. Oh, thanks, Mendez. Wait, what? That's the extent of what we get to know about Milton? I was four when Milton disappeared. Mm -hmm. Wow, so we don't have any idea what happened to him. I know. Max from where the wild things are with his little crown. 
He is. So she was four when Melton disappeared. How old was he? Wait, wait, we can find this out. Edith was born in 99, and Milton was born in 92. So he was 11 when he disappeared. That doesn't bode well. Nope. I mean, not so young that he was dead, that he's definitely dead. Mom searching for my brother. Then she sealed the doors. But I don't have a lot of hope that an 11-year-old survives without anybody knowing where they are. Whatever Milton had found in the house, Mom didn't want it getting out. Wait, he found what? <gasps> Secrets. Oh, yeah. Where are we going? Oh, looks like we're going that way. I don't... Oh, crap. <laughs> Great job. Yeah, what if he tried to come home? <laughs> Mom definitely blamed Edie, but I think Lewis blamed himself. After he graduated, he just spent more and more time in his room. Until Mom got him a job at the cannery. This room is a boat! In a tree! This house is rad. Yeah, see, I told you. With the exception of the fact that everybody who lives in it dies. Okay, just chill out. Hey, Luca. Lewis's room smelled very, very familiar. That part of him lived on. She's saying he stinks. She's saying he was a stoner. Oh, I get. He was it. so proud of being Indian. I think for him, it was a way to be something other than oh, just a finch. I'm wondering, yeah. It might be a bong. She, she might be saying he's a stoner. She might just be Lewis a and I spent a lot of time playing games together, <laughs> but he was surprisingly bad at them. He died a lot. Uh -huh. That's covered because he's dead. We're assuming. Wait, 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 go back. What? Nah, he's a stoner. Oh, yeah. Totally. He died a lot. People are saying a PS1? Smoking hookah is bad, okay? Well, yeah, a PS1. He probably died in the, like, early 2000s. Dear Mrs. Finch, as Lewis's psychiatrist, I can understand your desire for an explanation. As I see it, the trouble began in January, shortly after we convinced your son to seek treatment for substance abuse. Newly sober, I believe Lewis first noticed the monotony of his daily life. He kept working at the cannery. But he withdrew part there we of himself. Go. I don't know, but I hate this. In our sessions, I saw the same behavior. You know when it's over. His mind began to. Wonder. Oh. Speak up, woman. I'm controlling. I asked him to describe else. it. He said he started small. I might. You know what? I might not need to do Imagining anything. a labyrinth. He'd feel his way about. I still have to do missions, otherwise I can't see. Then something moved. Bats. And toads. And things that have not names. Oh, 
He knew it was all in his head. But he took it very seriously. I had hoped he'd find himself. But he found something more. I worried about him then. Daydreaming at the cannery. I spoke with his boss. But he said Lewis had become a model employee. Methodical, tireless, focused. Like a whole new Lewis. So I let him go on. I even encouraged him. It seemed very promising at first. He told me he'd made a new friend. An imaginary friend? That's a new friend. On the edge of a city he named Lewis Topia. He built the city up slowly, brick by brick. Then he made musicians. Oh, the people love him. He's so great. And songs for them to play. He's insane. Yes. And a drug addict. He talked about starting a band. And he was always humming something. Every day his imagination grew stronger. He no longer spoke at the cannery. But his chopping was as reliable as ever. Then one day it struck him. What? Cut his at all off. the cheering crowds, yep. even the stones under his feet, were all in his imagination. So he could do whatever he wished. Oh, God. He held an election for mayor. And he won. They begged him to stay, but his mind was already wandering. It became a game for him. He'd conquer a city, then immediately push on. New Lewisville. St. Louis. St. Louis. <laughs> he started drifting away from our reality. Minneapolis. <laughs> Until one day he forgot to go home from the cannery. Even as his mother pleaded with him, part of Lewis kept sailing on. Whee! In Lewisburg, he heard rumors of a What do you think? Beautiful prince. Beautiful prince? Ah, uh, yeah. He heard rumors of a beautiful, beautiful prince. Beautiful prince. Ah. The prince was on his own quest for... Rainbows or serpents? Serpents. Oh. Went that way the last time. So. Sinister serpents. He followed the sound of his electric guitar or sitar. sitar. Yeah, that. Yeah. Electric sitar. They're voting. Why are they voting? He 
this chase led him to a golden palace east of the sun and west of the moon. Even then, his logic remained sound. He knew the world was all in his imagination. But he was so proud of having created it. In his own eyes, he'd become something greater than a king. He's God. For someone who'd never known success in the real world, I think it was overwhelming. And then it struck him that the real Lewis was not the one chopping salmon, but the one climbing the steps of a golden palace. My imagination is as real as my body, he told me. It was hard to argue with him. Hey, we're not chopping salmon anymore. Oh, because we're, we're in the cannery now. Yeah, this is not going to end well. began to forget the world we know. Yeah. I think it pained him to remember Lewis, the cannery worker. He's gonna shove himself into the plate. Cut his own head off or something. Probably. He began to despise the man with a royal contempt. Hi. What you doing? That's him. I know. Thought I was supposed to do something. I still thought I could save him. Even after he said he was being crowned king over all the lands of wonder. The palace would be packed with his companions. insisted on advising him. It's like a train wreck, I can't look away. Yeah, seriously, I'm like, what's happening? <laughs> Your son was a kind man who will be missed by all of us who knew him. Ugh. God, that's horrible. My brother was really cool. I wish you could have met him. Oh, we're getting real close to being done with this. God, that's horrible. We've got most of that family filled in now. Why? Why is everybody in this family crazy? Or, or just hallucinating or whatever? Now we're going on top of the boat. On the way back from Lewis's funeral, 
My mom told me to start packing. She waited until the day before we left to tell Edie. I'm not sure if she wanted to make it easier or harder. Would, I guess, I guess that would be harder, wouldn't it? To just be told, hey, pack up your bags, because tomorrow we're going to your grandson's funeral. No, she said on the way back from his funeral. Oh. Like they were leaving. Oh, even worse. I wish we'd stayed. But I understand why we left. Is this our room? My mom ended up leaving everything behind. Or her mom's room. What happened that night had been coming for a long time. Maybe it should have come sooner. Definitely our room. But it had to end one way or another. All that's left now is to tell you about that last night. Bye, Erica. Go, go do your laundry. I think this is the end of the game. This is not a drug trip simulator, Erica. Well, parts of it kind of are. Well, fine. <laughs> Bye, honey. Thanks for coming and hanging out for a second. We're doing another game night in a couple weeks, so you better be there. Oh, yeah, I still not I gotta, I gotta schedule it. That whole last day, Edie just watched us pack and didn't say a word. Until supper, when she raised her glass and said, To our final night together, and all our final nights apart. Grandma, you know what I said about alcohol. Some of your medications are very Eden, specific. I left a present for you in the hallway. Why don't you go open it? The grown-ups have to argue now. <laughs> I'm sorry, you're right. We're all leaving tomorrow. Let's just enjoy our last... I'm not leaving. Edith, you're excused. If this were VR, I think the Lewis part would give people heart attacks. Yeah. Kneeling down and getting your The power head had been shut off up. that morning, but Edie always had plenty of candles. When my mom sailed the library, I don't think she knew about the other entrance. Or that Edie had a key to it. I didn't mean to turn around. That thing you're afraid of isn't going to end when you leave the house. Edith has a right to know these stories. My children are dead because of your stories. I think it's best. If Edith and I leave tonight, we'll have the nursing home send a van for you in the morning. Okay? Well, that's sad. Dear Edith, there's so many stories I wish I could tell you, but there's only time for one. This is about what happened on the night you were born. That night, the tide went way, way out. It was the first and last time I ever saw the old house aground. There'd been an earthquake out in the middle of the ocean. They called it the lowest tide in a thousand years. God, it smelled awful. No. I've seen that house every day of my life. But I never thought I'd go back to it. When the fog rolled in, I lost my way. Uh oh. I 
I got turned around. What? How? I didn't turn. <laughs> I started seeing things. Follow the deer. What did it jump over? I don't follow it. Something's gonna kill it. Things I'd forgotten had ever existed. It's a bed. But when I saw them, they felt like old friends. That night, a lot of things came back to me. Or maybe I came back to them. She's gonna bring something. You think? Maybe he's still alive. Maybe he broke the curse. Things I can't explain, but that I need you to try and... Edith, what are you doing in here? It's mine. Edith! Mom, you're gonna rip it! Let go! I kicked and screamed, but... Mom dragged me to the car. I never saw Great Grandma Edie again. Hi, Grandma. The next morning, the band came to pick her up, but she was already gone. Ran away After that, milk. we moved around a lot. Ooh, we both tried to make the best of it. A few years went by. My mom didn't like to talk about it. But she started getting sick a lot. <coughs> the rest happened pretty quickly. Aww. She got better for a while. And then she didn't. And then I was alone. Last Finch left alive. That's, that's not really like until I found out about you. <gasps> I'm still not sure what to tell you about all this. Oh, the baby. If we lived forever, we maybe we'd have time to understand things. But as it is, I think the best we can do is try to open our eyes. And appreciate how strange and brief all of this is. I don't know if this journal was supposed to be for you. I don't know if Mom's death is really the curse, because it's just but illness. Now I hope you'll never see it. Everybody else died in like. Three I just want to meet you and tell you all these stories myself. The baby's been born. By the way. But I guess if you're reading this now. Things didn't work out that way. This is where your story begins. I'm sorry I won't be there to see it. It's a lot to ask, but I don't want you to be sad that I'm gone. I want you to be amazed that any of us ever had a chance to be here at all. Good luck. We weren't, Edith. The whole time, we were her baby. We were what remains of Edith Finch. I feel like we missed a couple people, though. There were a couple names in the book that didn't have pictures next to them. We got them all? Okay. That, that is, that is a tragic game. I, 
I don't know if, uh, I don't know. I kind of liked, uh, Gone, Gone Home and, and Tacoma, maybe, a little better than this one. Well, this was just really sad. This was just really sad, and, and I feel like with both of those, they were a little bit mystery, a little bit intrigue, you know? Figuring stuff out as we went. And this one is more just, you know, you know how everything's gonna end, pretty much. I mean, there's that one twist at the very ending, but... The photos are pretty cute for... They are. Jay says, okay, upbeat time. I have a winner of our lottery. Woo! This is a really cute credit sequence. I like this. <laughs> yeah. Ah, the rock wall. Thanks, Johan. Was an achievement we just unlocked. <laughs> Pringer Zero asks if we've ever heard of Soma. Yes, uh, I think that was recommended for one of our horror nights. I think the mystery is here is making sense of how the deaths happened or whatever. Maybe. Mm. Whoopsh. Whoopsh. Jay has gifted a subscription to Asune Shoku. Yay. Congrats. And and thank you again, Jay. I still think Near Gestalt is sadder than this. Oh. We haven't finished Near the first. That is on the list. That one and uh, and the rest of Fire Emblem Echoes, I gotta finish too. Oh, well, that was fun. <laughs> In a morbid tragedy sort of way. Mm -hmm. We probably could have played through all of this in one sitting, but we kind of started a little late the first time. Mm -hmm. Are these people... Who are these people? Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Mm -hmm. They were some department, I'm guessing. Yes, Alm did come in fourth in the new favorite heroes character poll on Fire Emblem. So he gets a new portrait or something. Play a story option is now available. Okay, well, this will tell us if we missed any stories. We didn't get his picture. Wait, what does that mean? Oh, I guess that's the same. It's the same story. Yeah. I see. But we didn't... I don't think we saw Sam's. I think that's the only one we're missing, but I think... I don't think we saw this one. Let's see. Oh, yeah, we didn't go in here. Yeah, we didn't Sam come in Sam spent here. his life shooting photos, but... Oh. Mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. We did guess come we're in all here. Afraid of something. We, just went we completely missed this. Yeah. 
Hmm? Dawn, I promise you'll never forget this weekend. Yes, sir. These memories are going to last a lifetime. Mm -hmm. Am I going to have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Dawn. Shooting is strongly encouraged. Perfect. It's going to rain the whole weekend, isn't it? I'll never forget this weekend, Dad. That's the spirit. Okay, got it. I'm going to take some pictures, okay? Just be careful. The camera's older than you are. Aww. Bye, birdie. More birdies. You're right, Dad. It's starting to clear up. Still freezing, though. I'm just taking pictures of stupid stuff. Caitlin, warning. Caitlin, it might get squeamish. squeamish oh no, squirmish. it's a hunting trip. Oh, I don't want to see this. Oh, I'm probably supposed to like take a picture of a deer as it's about to get shot or something. Oh god. But I don't see any deer. Should not have drunk all that coffee. Oh, nothing quite like being outside. Hmm. Oh. Hold still while I take a picture of you. I definitely won't be moving. Are you done yet? Hey! <laughs> That's a keeper. Oop. A little more gas in the tank, I guess. I'm just saying. I'm not always going to be here, Don. You'll need to remember this stuff, if you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was going to be fine? Some guy who died. Don, I'm being serious. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being out here make you want to chill out? Well, to tell you the truth, I haven't been out here in 20 years. Last time I was with my brother. Don, don't you think you could find something more interesting to photograph? No. Your grandpa Sven taught us how to fish. How to build a fire. We found an old logging trail. There were deer everywhere. How long? I bet if I could remember where that trail was, we'd spot a buck for you in no time. Give me a minute to check the map. He's gonna get mauled by a bear. He dies, remember? Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's see. It's horrible. But it's so peaceful. Maybe. It's not gonna be peaceful. There's gonna be a fucking animal that's gonna take him out. Any more film on me, kiddo? What am 
I supposed to take a picture of? I'm twisted. I'm supposed to find the path somehow. Zoom in on the little island? Well, I guess I didn't take any pictures of that yet. From here. No. You're just snapping pictures of nothing. statue or something. I already took that picture. Take a photo of the tent. I can't go that far right. I'll just try to you in that direction. Oh wait, there's a bird. Oh, <gasps> there's a deer. Good eyes, Don. No. Before you take the shot, let me get a picture of it. Dad's taking a picture. Dad. Oh, we're taking a I... picture of her. Just breathe. Let me get the other. I don't like this. Do I have to do this? Don, you don't have to do anything. But if you want to survive, you'll need to be strong. D the deer's not gonna hurt you. Great shot, Don. Ah, oh, don't look at it. Okay, it's gone. Oh, well, there's a dead deer now. I'm proud of you, Don. Always remember that, okay? Make it stop. Why can't I? Oh, oh, I see. Sorry, Don. Just got to reset the timer. I hope you fall. I hope you die. Oh, wait, you do. Good. Fall. Dad, it's twitching. Yeah, I think that's it's totally so normal, Don. Just focus on the camera. Try not yep. to think about Dad! it. <laughs> oh! Wow, and they and she kept the photo. Of all these stories, <laughs> that's the one I wish most that my mom had told me. Bye. Nature always wins, says Jeff B. Yeah. Fuck you. Whoo! All right, there's that. There's that achievement. The end of everything. Now Great. we've seen all the stories. Bye. Huh. Yeah, there's a lot of animal death in this game, yeah, too, not a fan. in addition to all the people death. All right. Well, that is the end of that chapter. <sighs> what, what did I do? That comes here, and we go to that. Okay. There's a lot of death, yeah, in... in general yeah well uh so it was a pretty short stream tonight but that was kind of all we had planned so i think we are going to call it but uh maybe that means that we'll be back on i will definitely be back on sooner than we were last time because we're not going out of town for five days like we did last week
Um, product placement on the chair, sponsored by Diet Coke. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> and I have a Canada Dry over here, <laughs> which is also a Coke product, uh, I think. Right? I don't know. It doesn't matter. Um, so, that's the end of tonight's broadcast. Uh, but if you are interested, let me know um, about uh, subscriber-only anime watch parties, because I'm thinking about doing that. Um, Wait, like you watch anime together? Yeah. Not on Twitch. On Through another service that lets you, like... You, you all look at like a shared internet browser, and you can go to Netflix and stuff, and watch stuff on there. Oh. So. Yeah. Okay. Um. Unless I like the anime, I definitely won't do that with you guys. It's okay. It's it's probably gonna be, like, binge fests of yeah, rabbit rab rab dot it, Jay. Um, it's gonna, it's gonna be, like, binge fests of things like, uh, Mob Psycho 100 and Devil Man Crybaby, maybe, although that one's pretty adult-oriented. I don't know if I can make sure that everybody's 18 and older. Um. What, you have to regulate the internet now? Uh, probably not. Gundam. Sorry. Uh. If you're, if you're a baby and you listen to me, I'm sorry. Uh, maybe, uh. Maybe your lie in April, the the stuff that, you know, mm-hmm. stuff that I'm, I play a relatively major role because that's relevant to this channel. Right. So you guys want to watch the anime I don't know. that well, Kyle's we'll, well, in we'll with Kyle? I don't know. We'll see. If, Welcome uh, to my world. If you, <laughs> if you guys are interested in such things, um, just let me know. In the Twitch chat or, or, or tweet me or, or whatever. Um, ba, 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 ba. And check out Unlocked. You're 23 and you feel old? <laughs> you're a baby. <laughs> baby, yeah. You're a baby. I'm 30. I don't tell people how old I am. I don't give a shit. <laughs> you can know. 87. I always... Uh, Bitch. People ask me how old I am, and I go, I'm... <laughs> I won't tell anybody how old you are. Mm. But now that they know how old I am. I mean, that doesn't really say anything about you. Now I'm spilling water all over myself. It's because you're an old man. Because I'm an old man. <laughs> Horrible. You love me. Uh, okay, so... You turn 20 this Sunday, and you feel old. Well... I've been feeling old since I was Sorry, 18. Sorry, Stairmaster, but you are no longer going to be a teenager. I, I Do you know that, felt like, old since I was 18. Women, uh, we don't actually become, like, adult. I don't know about men, but we don't become, like... Uh, mentally mature. Mentally mature until 23. 23? I thought it was, like, 25. No, well, I think it's, like, 23. 23 to 25. It's probably later for men than it is for women. Honestly, let's uh, I mean, we take longer to mature physically. So yeah, anyway, I turn uh, 21 soon. Oh, my God. You are a fetus. All right. Anyway, um, uh, check out Unlocked and there's a link for that on the page now. If you scroll down a little little ways. And, uh, and, uh, we, we did a, a, a stream, well, we, we did a pre-recorded thing of us playing through a game of Timeline out on the patio, uh, tabletop card game, which was fun, and... I was 18. I don't need to answer that. 18, you don't even exist yet. No, I'm just kidding. I'm so sorry. That was mean. I didn't mean it the way it came out. <laughs> Um, 18 means you're just real little. Um, uh, is Unlocked a- available for Android yet? No, it is not. They are aware that everybody that, that everybody wants it on Android. Um, 
I ask them about it regularly, and they they just uh, they can't do it yet. They're they it's it's first on their list of wants, but they they can't do it just yet. Um, so it's Apple devices exclusively. Uh, anyway, that is the end of tonight's broadcast. Thank you all so much for being I'm a part of it. Obsessed with fetus right now. <laughs> <laughs> extra extra boy i actually i can't take credit for that that was what when i was 18 i had a like a second cousin who i hadn't seen in a long time and that's what he called me because he was a like fetus. yeah he called me because he was like 20 years older than me and i remember when we met back up he was like hey fetus what's up <laughs> and i yeah. was like i'm 18 he's like yeah you're a fetus so hilarious Thank you, AKL M8. AKL Mate. AKL M8. Well, whatever. Thank you for the, the congrats on the fourth place in Fire Emblem Heroes. Obviously, I didn't have anything to do with that, really, but uh, nope. Alm did it, so cool. Yeah. Thank you guys for, for voting for him. You're not Alm? <laughs> like, not for real, sis? Sorry. <laughs> it's, it's funny, because, like, the people in this chat are very much aware of the fact that I'm Kyle, that I'm not, I'm, I am not the characters that I play, uh -huh. but there, there are a couple people who show up in the unlocked chat that try to talk to me as if I am one of my characters. Yeah. And it always weirds me out <laughs> a little bit. Yeah. It's just like, like, where'd you park your Gundam or something? And, and you're, you're like, like where'd, you, where'd you park, where'd you leave Barbatos? I'm like, ah. Uh, I'm not me because you, could, you should know. just start making up stuff. Like <laughs> he's in my backyard. It's cool. <laughs> well, I yeah, I started making. Actually, it was uh, it was it was something about like uh, don't do this to me, nines. He so is that, not nine there, ass. There was something like it, the 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 comment was something like uh, you should you know just get in you should just get in Barbatos and go beat beat this person up whatever the response was and I was like. Yeah, I'd do that, but I forgot where I parked him. Or something like that, you know? So you did play the game. I, well, yeah, a little Tell bit. Tell them your dog is a Gundam at that point. Chloe, are you a Gundam? She is asleep. Like, passed Ask out. Ask an anime character at Kawaii Con. What? That'd probably be really weird. Yeah, that would be really weird. Oh, no. No. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I could do that. I don't ever want to do that. Mm -mm. I'm I'm really not that great at improv, so <laughs> I'm not really good at censoring myself, so I probably shouldn't talk on most panels. Yeah. At conventions. Um Okay. Anyway, we are done with tonight's broadcast as I knock my glasses off my head. Uh thank you guys for hanging with me and Caitlin, and we will see you. Soon. Um, so yeah, we don't know. That's we'll figure it the, out. That's that's the approach to this to this channel now is we don't know. We'll figure it out. I mean, if you have like suggestions we for didn't... games that you think we'll like, you know, I like puzzle games and like shit like Edith Finch. Yeah. Now well, obviously, I'm... still got to play through the rest of Echoes. Got to play through the rest of Original Near. So Kate will say F you before anything. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Sorry. No, I'm an adult. I can keep myself at least somewhat censored sometimes. Oh, this stream is set to 18 plus Delta. If you, if you tune in, you're you're checking a little box that says, yes, I am 18 or older. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Because because of all because of, of the F-bombs. I do it too, just not as frequently. I did that. I did that. It's because <laughs> Kyle can't trust me to keep my mouth shut. <laughs> He's like, oh, God, my wife. What a sailor. My finger hurts. Oh, no. No, me. What? No, me's not 18. Why can't she or he? Is no, me female or male? Or what, what does no, me identify as? I don't know. But no, me. No, me's female. Female. Okay. Why doesn't she... Um, you know what, I th Why? Jay, I think it was marked 18 plus back in the near days, so she was bypassing that 18 plus 
filter anyway. Yeah. Um, I'm Tell guessing, her to lie. I'm guessing she's she's busy with school stuff. Unless she's heavily offended by my use of the uh, word fuck. I... Oh, Guys, I... my finger hurts. Oh, Kyle, shut up. <laughs> Kyle's finger hurt. Talk Chloe. Yeah, she's so mad at me. Look at her. We she's went like, climbing. What the hell? We went Look climbing. Look at this Ewok. Look at her. <laughs> Look at her on the screen. So this is an Ewok. We went, we went climbing today. This is an Ewok. And it's not going to focus on it, but you can kind of sort of see... One of my climbing calluses got ripped off on the rock wall, and it does not feel good. Barbados lupus rex. Do that's a. Uh, that's the last version of Barbados. Oh, it, is it? Yeah. Yeah, but that's what Chloe is, huh? Are you Barbados? She's so mad at me. Um. Okay, we are done. We love you all. Thank you for hanging out with us. While uh, yes, this was at a climbing gym, Jeff. Uh, we thank you for joining us for Edith Finch. Do we'll be back Chloe? to play something else uh, in, I don't know, Chloe's just sometime. Chloe hates me. Right Chloe's now. saying goodbye. Bye. <laughs> Bye, guys. Uh, let's do a, a <laughs> let's do, should we do a, let's do a, wait, what? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. On the count of three. Ready? One, two, three. Extra, extra fetus. Good night, everybody. Uh, what's with him? Oh, Kageyama passed out. Would you mind?